New Jersey, where some 60,000 people have gathered to see the first ever running of Thunder on the Beach. Semi-final round action right now as David Morris brings the pride of Tennessee to the line at the equalizer, and Tom Meats and the Monster Patrol roll up right now. These two guys have had a pretty easy go of it so far today, but now it's going to be all on the line because you're one step away from winning the final round here. Lots of people having fun as they're cheering on their favorites to victory. The equalizer, a Chevrolet, and a tough run. A bit running low, very, very close to the ground the entire time. Monster Patrol, well, he starts off with a good hole shot position, makes up some ground in between the set of cars, but he's been having a little bit of air towards the back end. Want to keep it low, horsepower to the ground. And what a big win it is. We just take everything I said and throw it out the window because the Monster Patrol gets a great launch at the very end and picks up the semi-final round win into the finals. Tom Meats wheels the Monster Patrol to the next round. Oh, you know, the teams are getting a little bit more used to this sand. This is the first time we ever ran out here or something like this. And all the trucks will be running a little bit better. And Got any secrets now's the time to reveal them as they get set for the finals bigfoot lonnie childers brings it to the line now he will be going up against the grave digger some breakage and some things have happened here where guys cannot answer the call for the next round so it's grave digger against bigfoot here in the semi-final rounds the winner will go on to meet the monster patrol great match up here lonnie childers in the far lane in the bigfoot cruiser up against Dennis Anderson's Grave Digger. Both these guys, heads up competition. It's anybody's ball game. It's anyone's race to win or lose. It's all the big push cruiser. Anderson gives it a good go at the very end, but Lonnie Childers is able to take home the win. He will match up against the patrol in the finals here on Thunder on the Beach. But Dennis Anderson provided a good weekend. Let's take another look at it as they lead just about even. But then the Bigfoot Ford horsepower comes to the line and takes home the win. A little wheel stand there from the showman, Dennis Anderson. Yeah, we usually don't run on the sand like this. Uh, it's a little bit different. We ran yesterday on it. Uh, ducks up pretty good. Ramps kind of went away toward the semifinals there. We had to rebuild the ramps. Uh, I really don't think we're going to do a whole lot different. Maybe get through the gears a little faster and try to get uh, try to get the tire speed up, and uh, hopefully we can take. Titles for the first ever Thunder on the Beach, and it's worked out very, very well. A challenge for drivers to figure out how to set up their vehicle for the sand. Not that the track's been bad, it's just tested their skill getting everything set up. You loosen your tire pressure up a little bit, you change some gears, that's what they're all doing. Tom Meets in the near lane, and in the far lane, Lonnie Childress in the big foot Ford. It's the Ford versus Chevrolet matchup for the first time here in southern New Jersey, and it's going to be big. Very well hit the jumps at the exact same time, and it's going to be Monster Patrol by just a couple of inches over Bigfoot. You can turn that a big upset. Tom Means has been driving for the past two and a half years. Lonnie Childers has been driving for Bigfoot for the past who knows how many years, and it just came down to leaving the line at the right time. Monster Patrol takes home the victory, the first ever here on Thunder on the Beach. Oh, it was, it was a, a fierce run between two great competitors, and uh, I think we narrowly pulled it out at the end there. Car, truck come out of the hole real good. You know, we cut a good light. Uh, sat down real good over the first set of cars there. Looked real good in between, you know. Um, I knew he was right there with us. I'd like to see the video myself, you know. I knew it was a close race, but... Uh, they went ahead and gave it to Tom. They, they called it a dead heat there for a minute. So, uh, like I said, I'd like to see the, the tape on it. But uh, I'd like to thank Ford and BDS and Firestone. You know, they did a real good job for us this weekend. Um, and thanks for having us out here on the